Hi everyone, it's great to be back with you and I'm especially looking forward to seeing many of you this coming Sunday, August the 16th, as we resume our in-person worship at Venice Presbyterian Church. It's been five months since we've been able to worship together in person. And we understand many of you will still feel more safe worshiping from your homes. But for those of you who are planning to attend this coming Sunday, I just wanted to use this midweek chat just to give you a little preview of what you might expect when you come this Sunday. First of all, when you come up, there will be a table at each of the doors outside of the narthex where you'll be greeted by someone uh, to take your temperature. This is just for the safety of everyone. And so um, we are inviting everyone to wear a mask as you enter the sanctuary building. And someone like Sherry here will take your temperature and will immediately give you the thumbs up to go in. Of course, if you aren't feeling well, please stay home. Um, again, this is just a precaution to make everyone feel as safe as possible when they come to worship together at Venice Presbyterian. Someone will have the door open for you so you don't have to open it yourself. That we'll have some wonderful greeters there. As you come in the narthex, and I'm just going to take off my mask just as I'm talking to you today, but as you come into the narthex, there will be one of our offering boxes here. There are also boxes at the other doors and in the sanctuary. So either before worship or after worship, you're invited to place your gift into that. We so appreciate all of your giving that allows us to continue our ministry. And I really encourage you to see this as an act of worship, just like you would if we were in the sanctuary with the plates being passed down the rows. Think of this as a moment of worship when you offer that gift to God. Think about that, that uh, poor widow who placed her coins in the treasury at the temple, knowing that Jesus saw her and loved her and approved of her. And I pray that even though this is different, you will see this as a special time to even begin your worship of God or to conclude your worship of God as you come out from the church sanctuary. So then, again, we're gonna to continue to invite you to wear your masks until you get into the sanctuary. And then once you get into the sanctuary, of course, if you feel more comfortable and you're socially distanced, we invite you to, for your own sake of comfort, to take the mask off if you're so comfortable doing that. But as we come into the narthex, there will be this registration table. And again, we're asking everyone to register for the services. Um, that's for, again, our preparations to know how many people are here to make sure we're social distancing. If you don't register by 4 p.m. Thursday afternoon, um, and you still feel a desire to come on Sunday morning, please come. You can just sign up here, sign your name here, and, and we expect that we will have room for you. As of today, we have about 82 people signed up for worship. Um, and um, so again, our sanctuary will not be totally filled, um, and we, we welcome you. To come, and of course, we'll welcome visitors who come as well. But we just ask that you come to the registration table. We ask you to bring your printout, and you can place it in this basket. Or if you didn't register ahead of time, just to sign up with a friendly volunteer here who will be masked at that table. And then we encourage you just to come on in and uh, to prepare your hearts to worship God in the sanctuary. When you come into the sanctuary, you'll notice that we broke off every other pew with a ribbon. Um, that's just, again, to encourage the social distancing that will help prevent the transmission of any virus. And so you'll just find a seat that doesn't have a ribbon in front of it. Make yourself comfortable. And here, we'll be back to worship God together as the family of God here at Venice Presbyterian Church. And we recognize that our family of faith will include many of you who continue to worship from home. Um, we are one family in Christ, and we look forward to celebrating that, whether you're here or whether you're choosing to remain at home. But 
But I do want to encourage you that if you come, know that we are um, doing what we can to make it a safe and a welcoming environment for everyone. As I say, it's great to be back with you. I've enjoyed some time with my family the last 10 days. Um, because of the nature of the world we're living in with the coronavirus, we didn't travel um, anywhere special, but it's amazing the many places I guess I have been going. And so just to give you a preview of the different places where I've been, enjoy this little video prepared by our staff. 